Welcome back to Crypto Warehouse. My name is Mike and today we're going to go through the news that Ajix, FET and Ocean have agreed to merge in a $7.5 billion alliance. We're going to take you through the news, have a little look at Fetch, have a look at what it's going to do to the AI crypto market and give you our conclusions as to where we see the price of this token going. Before I do any of that, can I please ask you to like and subscribe to Crypto Warehouse and help us make more videos like this. So if you are a long time viewer of Crypto Warehouse, you will know that we have been massively bullish on Singularity and Fetch AI for at least the last two years. We both hold those tokens in Singularity and Fetch, and we are very bullish on the AI crypto market in general. So we covered the news that these three tokens were going to merge about four or five weeks ago. I'll leave a link on the screen right now to that original video. And the announcement was going to be made any time after April the 19th. This vote has now concluded and the news is breaking that they are going to merge. I'm going to go through the Fetch blog post in a second, but very quickly just to recap. The smart contract holders for Singularity, Fetch and Ocean have passed a $7.5 billion merger, signing off the ASI, the Artificial Superintelligence Alliance token. The ASI token will have a total supply of 2.6 billion and will replace any Fetch, Ajix or Ocean tokens that you have in your exchange or in your non-custodial wallet. And we'll get onto that in a minute. The ratio will be one for one with FET and 0.43 to one for Ajix and Ocean tokens. The launch is scheduled for May the 24th. That is 20 days from the recording of this video, less than three weeks from now. This will create a decentralized AI infrastructure capable of handling big data. Now, the three tokens that are merging are not exactly the same. This is what makes this token so exciting. Fetch is popular for services in the area of computing by LLMs and AI agents. Singularity is exploring AI in applications and Oceans act as a platform for tokenized data sets. So they are not the same. We are not comparing apples with apples. We're comparing apples with pears with bananas. I don't like bananas. Okay, you want an apple? Now, if we head over to Fetch, just to read through a little bit of their blog post, one very important factor that they've mentioned on here. They will become a significant player in AI research and development. This alliance not only signifies a milestone in response to the rapid growth of AI projects, but also aims to challenge the dominance of big tech in AI development, utilization and monetization. And that, if you read between the lines, is talking about Microsoft and Google. They will dominate the AI space unless somebody comes along and challenges them. And that is this merger in a nutshell. We're thrilled to announce the successful conclusion of the token merger voting process. This marks the beginning of a new chapter in AI development where our collective efforts will drive progress towards decentralized AGI and ASI. Our mission is to create a decentralized AI infrastructure at scale, ensuring ethical and trustworthy practices. By combining our platforms, we empower developers and users alike, fostering a more democratic and transparent AI ecosystem. And this is to challenge the threats we've just mentioned. We do not want a future where Terminators are roaming freely, taking us out one by one. Of course, I'm a Terminator. And finally then, here is the breakdown. FET becomes ASI with a total supply of 2.63055 billion tokens. AGIC tokens migrate to ASI at a conversion rate of 0.433350 to 1, and Ocean migrates at almost the same rate. Now, what is this going to do to the market? Well, at the time back in April when we were at all-time highs, we were talking about a $7.5 billion merger. Since then, the markets have retraced somewhat. Now, NEAR Protocol is the top AI token at the moment with a market cap of 7.4 billion dollars. That would make ASI the top token, but as we've said, the markets have retraced slightly. And if we scroll down a little bit, you'll see that Fetch is just under 2 billion, Singularity is 1.1 billion, and Ocean is 500,000. So you would be looking at the moment, anyway, at least at a three and a half. A $4 billion project. That would put 
the new token in second position below near protocol but above render making it the second largest ai and big data token in the world now recently near protocol have announced that they have some mega bullish news coming soon and i expect near protocol to be somewhere near $20 in the near to short term future and I would expect the new ASI token to absolutely rip. Why? Because the whole is greater than the sum of the parts. This new project covers so many more bases than each project on its own. So together they will become a formidable AI project and we may not see the benefits of this for at least a year. Remember when companies merge and projects form an alliance they do have some crossovers and it will take some time for us to see the real benefits of this merger, but we will see it and that is the key. Remember, Fetch and Singularity and Ocean are three emerging projects. AI in general is an emerging project. You are getting into these projects at the very beginning. You are still early as far as this is concerned. Do I think that Near or new ASI will become a $50 billion project in the future? Absolutely. But do not expect that to happen tomorrow or in 2024 or even in 2025. I do think we're going to see multiples of most of the top successful AI tokens in the near future. In the next 18 months, we could see five to 10 Xs on a lot of these projects, but some of them are not going to make it. Some of them are there solely on their name. So you need to do your own research and find the projects that are going to be successful. And in my opinion, and it's not financial advice, ASI, Near Protocol are going to be two of the very top AI tokens in the future. So just to recap then, the new coin will be launched on the 24th of May. And remember what I said before, I would get back to the point of what happens to claim your new tokens. Well, first of all, if you are on a centralized exchange, your tokens will be automatically swapped to the new token. So you will have to do nothing. Secondly, if you hold your tokens in MetaMask or a non-custodial wallet, you will be able to go to Fetch, Singularity or Ocean Protocol and swap your tokens there. Now, we covered this in the last video, but just a reminder, there is no time limit to swap these tokens. There is an indefinite period of time where you can swap. It is not going to end this year or next year. You will be able to swap them at your leisure. So please bear that in mind and do not panic that you're going to lose your tokens. With all that being said, I hope you like this short video. I'm as excited as I imagine many of you are about this merger. So do us a favor, smash the subscribe button, hit the like button. And if you want to become an OG member for a few dollars a month, help support us financially. You have been great as always. I have been Mike. Goodbye.